It has been a breakout season for 261-pound, 7-footer Justin Dahl. The UNI coaching staff knew that he had the potential to be a big contributor for the Panthers the next couple of years. The Carver, Minnesota native set the Holy Family Catholic High School record for points, blocks, and rebounds in a single season, and he had the eighth highest single season rebounding total in the state of Minnesota. Justin came to UNI and redshirted in 2015 and saw action in 13 games in the 2016-17 season. Last year, he only played in two games, but he never gave up on his dream, and that motivated him to do more in the offseason. In previous years, I felt like conditioning was my biggest issue, so this year I ran a lot in the offseason, and uh, it's showing on the court. I feel like I'm better able to go after loose balls and rebounds and play defense, so I feel like it really paid dividends. Justin's commitment to getting into the best shape of his career has been, has been really fun to watch. And he's done that. And he's put a lot of time in on his own to get in the gym this summer to run. And not only to shed pounds, uh, but to get into his best shape. And you know, his weight hasn't changed a whole lot because he's gotten stronger, but his body fat's dropped a ton. And his ability to then be mobile on the court is where it translates. His ability to run up and down the floor, to chase down a loose ball, to show on a ball screen. He's way ahead of where he's been in years past uh, because of the time he put in this offseason to get into shape. Justin has been called upon to do a lot of little things for the Panthers this season due to the health issues with teammates Shanda Goldman and Austin Fife. Justin is averaging 10 minutes per game along with 2.3 points, nearly three rebounds, and a strong inside presence in the half-court defense. Justin has been extremely efficient with his shots, connecting on a team best 57% from the floor. Coaches and fans have loved the energy and effort that he has brought to this team. First and foremost, because all the work he's done is starting to pay off a little bit more. I mean, he hasn't seen the court a lot over his first couple of years here, but I think the way his body's changed and the shape he's got himself into, uh, we've really started to see some differences in practice. Some of the plays he's able to make now just show the signs of growth in his development. And I think that's the biggest thing for him. Um, a lot of guys can lose a little bit of confidence, a little bit of faith if they don't start to see some, some development or some you know, some fruits of their labor, and I think he's starting to see it in practice, and hopefully that carries over onto the court. There's still plenty more Panther Sports Talk coming up on the show, including a feature on men's basketball sophomore Taiwan Pickford. We feature the women's basketball leading rebounder and more with head wrestling coach Doug Schwab.